This beautiful fortress next to this great lake is Jhansi's hidden gem. Known as Barua Sagar, it served as a summer retreat to the Rajas of Orcha and Jhansi and has been a witness to events which shaped Bundelkhand's history. Located 22 kilometers around southeast of Jhansi, the Barua Sagar Fort was constructed by the Bundela ruler Raja Udit Singh of Orcha between 1705 and 1707 CE. It stands adjacent to a large lake from which it gets its name, Barua Sagar. Inside the fort were palaces and temples, the remains of which can still be seen today. Jhansi and much of the region around it formed a part of Raja Chhatrasal's kingdom, who gave it to Maratha Peshwa Bajirao I in 1729 CE for helping him against the Mughal governor Muhammad Khan Bangash. Following this, the Peshwas appointed a series of Maratha governors who administered their possessions from Jhansi. By the end of the 18th century, as the Maratha influence in the region declined, the Nevalkar family, who were once subedars or governors on behalf of the Peshwas, declared Jhansi a quasi-independent state. Eventually, the Barua Sagar Fort complex and its surrounding areas came under their control. Interestingly, Barua Sagar Fort also served as refuge for Gangadhar Rao Nevalkar, Rani Lakshmibai of Jhansi's husband, who had to leave Jhansi due to palace intrigues in the 1830s. Raja Gangadhar Rao became the Raja of Jhansi in 1843, after which he moved to Jhansi from Barua Sagar. Sadly, he passed in 1853, following which Jhansi was annexed by the British. In 1857, a big revolt broke out in Jhansi under the leadership of Rani Lakshmibai, who expelled the British and took control of Barua Sagar Fort. Taking advantage of the political instability, on 10th August 1857, the Orcha Diwan or Prime Minister Nathya Khan captured the Barua Sagar Fort through which he laid siege to Jhansi despite protests by the British. Under the command of her father, Moropant Tambe, and with the help of the Raja of Banpur, Mardan Singh, Rani Lakshmi Bai took 4,000 troops from Orsha to recapture Barua Sagar Fort. The fort eventually came under the British hands on 6th March 1858, when the troops under Hugh Rose won over the 20,000 troops of one of the leaders of the revolt, Tatya Tope. The Barua Sagar Fort was turned into a rest house for the touring British officers, surveyors and picnickers who compared its beauty with the castles of Europe. Now protected by the State Archaeological Department of Uttar Pradesh, the Barua Sagar Fort is a popular gateway among tourists whose grandeur never fails to charm.